A lot happening. I know the election's on Tuesday, but you know what's happening tonight? The Badger basketball season is officially underway as they take on UW Oshkosh at the Cold Center. Recent news this week that small forward Liam Ford has a sprained knee is out indefinitely, and that's too bad. He will come back sometime this year. But last year, for the first time since 1998, the Badgers didn't get in the tournament, but it wasn't the fault of Coach Greg Gard. You had injuries to Dimitri Trice and to guard Kobe King, and you had Brad Davison playing with a bad shoulder all year. All that stuff's cleaned up. They also added a guard from Green Bay, a transfer, Trevor Anderson. Ethan Happ, who I think could be an All-American, is back inside. You have a guy in Nate Reavers, the center from Minnesota, who gained 28 pounds coming into this year. He was a little too skinny a year ago. This is a Badger team that has picked fifth in the entire Big Ten of 16 teams by Street and Smith in the Big Ten rankings. This Badger team could be very good and could come very well back into that flow of getting in the NCAA tournament. Uh, Coach Guard was determined after last year never to have uh, a problem in the backcourt again to injuries. They have five guards on tap, including talented freshman from St. Petersburg, Florida, Ty Strickland, the son of Rod Strickland, who played 17 years in the NBA. They've added some nice newcomers in the mix. It's a very talented Badger team. They're all young men that are very articulate and good kids. I saw them at the preseason dinner. Cold Center. I have high hopes for this Badger team as basketball season gets started. Expect for Greg Gard and the Badgers to be back in the winning circle once again. My two cents, my two minutes are brought to you by Capital Consultants and Edge Construction. Mike Tuig and his staff can redo your kitchen, your basement, your bathroom, your staircase. Make your home feel just like home. Talk about this some more next time on Two Minutes with Mitch.